Welcome back to Wine Direct Essentials Building a Club Video 2. In this video, we'll be going over the remaining steps after building out the general club information. Let's get to it. Picking up from where we left off, we've made our adjustments to the general information and press save. For those of you who have been on platform for a while and haven't opted into using user's choice club functions, you won't have the ability to add promos directly in the club. For those with User's Choice Club, you'll be able to add a club promo here. You'll need to make a promo specific for this club. Be sure to review our promos video or documentation on how to build promos. Once you add the promo to the club, it will affect the price of any product you add to the season offering. You can only use one discount to affect pricing. Once that's done, you can take a look at the description. The description of the club is another what you see is what you get or WYSIWYG. The description is visible during club signup and whenever a club member accesses their club list to make customizations. The description can add length to the page, so it's typically best to either keep it short or add inventory with the user's choice club to even things out. Next, if you're using a user's choice club, you'll have the ability to create user's choice seasons here. If you've chosen not to create a user's choice club, then you won't see this. To add a season, simply click on the green add a season button. For more information, review our user's choice club season video or documentation. Some additional club options, regardless of user's choice functionality, is the welcome package and prepay options. The welcome package will immediately create an order for a member upon sign up. If you're signing club members up directly in the tasting room, it will generate an order for them while in the tasting room. Based on the member's preferences at sign up, it will automatically generate either a pickup order or a shipping order. Welcome packages will also be created for members who sign up online but please note that members cannot opt themselves out of welcome packages when signing up online, nor can they be opted out by staff when signing up in the tasting room. You can create a prepay option for any club you build. To do this, click the edit option and select club has prepay in the drop down. You'll then define how many shipments that prepay option is worth. Generally, when it's a prepaid club, you'll want to build it as a standard allocation club. If you allow for the customer to make customizations with user's choice functionality, they will have already paid and you open up the opportunity for them to add additional wines to their order without incurring extra charges. You'll need to define the number of shipments the customer will receive and a description of the number of shipments they'll receive. Next, you'll need to include a SKU which will appear on the customer's invoice. Finally, you'll define the prepay rate, which will be the subtotal of all of the combined shipments for this prepay option. If you'd like, you can also create multiple prepay options for customers. Once you've made the appropriate adjustments, press save. By creating a prepay option, You'll give customers the option to either participate with the club on an ongoing basis or prepay for however many shipments you've entered or they've selected. Once a prepaid member has received all their shipments, their membership will be canceled. Thanks for joining. See you in the next video.